वेलकम टू द जावा प्रोग्रामिंग सीरीज एंड टुडे वी विल अंडरस्टैंड हाउ टू राइट डाउन द प्रोग्राम टू चेक गिवन नंबर इज प्राइम और नॉट सो बिफोर वी जंप इनटू द प्रोग्राम लेट्स ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड व्हाट इज अ प्राइम नंबर सो प्राइम नंबर इज अ नंबर दैट इज डिविजिबल बाय ओनली वन एंड इटसेल्फ राइट सो इफ यू ट्राई टू फाइंड द डिवाइजर ऑफ द प्राइम नंबर यू विल गेट ओनली टू डिवाइजर वन एंड इटसेल्फ so if you are getting any number which can able to divide only by 1 and itself that is the prime number so take an example so these are the prime number so take an example number 7 right so you will not able to find any number which can divide the 7 okay except 1 and 7 take another example let's say 13 so you will not able to find any number which can able to divide 13 except 1 and 13 so these are the prime number so we have to write down the program to check given number is prime or not perfect so let's try to find out the input required in this program so what is the input required in this program so definitely we have to take one number right we have to take a number from user to check number is prime or not so let me take a number let's say integer number is equal to 7 now let's identify the output so in the output we just have to print either it's a prime number or it's a not prime so we have only two output whether it's a prime or whether it's a not prime now let's try to find out the logic how can we check that given number is prime or not so let's try to build the logic so let's say we have a number which is 7 and i want to check the given number is prime or not so what we have to do i will just check number from 1 to 7 so 1 2 3 4 5 6 and 7 I will just try to check are we getting any number from 1 to 7 which can divide the number 7 so can we divide the number 7 with 1 yes right can we divide the number 7 with 2 no 3 no 4 no 5 no 6 no 7 yes so basically first of all we will try to find the divisor of the number 7 and after that we will check how many divisor we are getting if we are getting exactly two divisor then we can say number is prime number if we are getting the divisor that is greater than 2 then we can say the number is not prime right so that is our logic if we are getting the divisor of a number that is exactly 2 right then we can say it's a prime number and if we are getting the divisor that is the greater than 2 then it's not prime right so we got the condition so let me just write down the condition so i can just write down that if we will just take some count right count of the divisor so if count is equal to equal to 2 then it's a prime number and if count is greater than 2 that means else part because we know that any number has a minimum to count right so if we are getting the count which is greater than 2 then it's a not prime right so if count is equal to 2 then it's a prime else it's a not prime now we just have to focus on how to find the count so we know that how to find the divisor of the number so what we have to do first of all we have to generate the number from 1 to given number and we know that how to do that so we can just take the for loop integer i is equal to 1 i less than or equal to given number and i plus plus so if i'll try to print the number i then definitely it will print the number from 1 to 7 now we don't have to print the number from 1 to 7 what we need to check we need to check the divisor right so if any number that is the i can divide the our number 7 okay so if 7 is divisible with this number that means we are getting the remainder 0 if number modulo i that means the number 7 modulo 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 7 if we are getting the remainder 0 then we have to increase the count that count plus plus that means it's a divisor so we have to increase the count of divisor right and i can just initialize the count with the zero perfect so our number is 7 we are initializing count with zero after that we are executing this for loop seven times right because it's a less than or equal to number after that we are checking that all the number from 1 to 7 any number divides the 7 we are just incrementing the value of count by 1 So if we are getting the divisor that is more than 2 then the value of count will be more than 2 right if we are getting exactly 2 divisor the count value is 2 so we are just checking here if count is equal to exactly 2 it's a prime number else it's not prime 
okay so in the else part the count value will be greater than 2 right so it's a else part perfect so let's try to execute this program with the number 7 so first of all let me just activate the console screen and let me just try to run the program with the number 7 and you can see it's a prime number i can just check with the 13 as well let me just run this program and you will able to see it's a prime number and let's say 14 so 14 is not prime so it should print it's a not prime perfect so we have written the program to check given number is prime or not so i hope you are clear now how to write down the program to check given number is prime or not so that's it for today's video i hope you enjoyed it if you have any comments regarding this video try to write down into the comment section thanks everyone and we'll see you into the next video